Good morning or good afternoon or good evening. So today I'm going to be discussing the forms that I couldn't remember in the last video regarding the the uh, forms regarding the administrative courts needing to be taxed and the form that you needed. You will also need a 1040. Uh, you also need a uh, the form that you're looking for for that actually shows and states this is the fiduciary 56 form IRS December version from 2019. Now the K1 form is also a beneficiary form for the beneficiary holders of the accounts which is the representation of themselves you remember you represent yourself in all matters you don't want everyone an attorney to represent you I also look up I uh, also be I also looked up um, this information um, I found some publications as well from the IRS I will be posting here as well I want people to know this this is information that is public but should be kn that many people do not know that needs to be known this is the proper an uh, ethical way to do it. And I will discuss those forms as well um, when I am able to print those out at a later date and time as well. Um, I've, I've already sent in my forms, but I also have an EIN I uh, discussed. I will also be posting the uh, the EIN and how to get an, uh, an EIN number and become the equitable uh, title holder of the employee which they're using which is the trade name that you have um so um this this has just been an update on the beneficiary stuff i just want to do a quick one about two minutes here thank you watch share subscribe comment educate others thank you